My name is Juicing Jim, and today I'm going to tell you about ginger. Ginger is traditionally used for anti-nausea, is used for an upset stomach. But I like to also use it during flu season. If I feel myself getting a cold, if I feel like I'm getting a sore throat or my sinuses are stuffy, I'll take off a piece of ginger, I'll peel it, and then chew it raw. It's a very warming root. It warms your body when you eat it in the winter. So I like to add it to tea, to oatmeal, to anything that I might have in the winter time. Today, we're going to use ginger in a juice. We've got all of these healthy ingredients here that we're gonna put in the juice, but the one thing the juice is missing is the nice kick of ginger. So we've got carrots here for beta carotene. We've got our leafy greens and kale. We've got cucumber, which is a nice cooling vegetable. And we've got some apple, which will add a little bit of sweetness. And then last but not least, of course, we're gonna add the ginger. I'm gonna chop these vegetables to get them ready for the juicer. Carrots, I'll give a nice cut to there. The apple. I'm gonna cut the kale. And now I'll cut the cucumber. And last but not least, I'm gonna cut the ginger. I like to peel the skin off of the ginger. If you don't peel the skin off the ginger, you're gonna get a very earthy flavor that's added to the juice, which is fine, but some people prefer not to have that. They just want the ginger spice flavor. All right, everything's chopped up and ready to feed through the juicer now. What we've got here is a low heat extracting juicer. Because it's low heat, it doesn't kill any of the enzymes that are in the food. Those enzymes are great for digestion and they're also really healthy. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start feeding food through here the juice is going to come out through the bottom into this bowl here, and then the pulp is going to come out through the end and land in this bowl here. Let's juice! Okay, we're going to start with carrots. We're going to add some cucumber. We'll throw in some kale. Add a little bit of apple for some sweetness. And then last but not least, ginger. And here's Juicing Jim's ginger juice. Mmm, taste that ginger kick. For the full recipe, go to yogajourneys.tv.